presenting the graduation address is the president of the student council, Dana Mutis. Good evening, Board of Education, Shore Regional Administrators, faculty, parents, students, and my fellow graduates of the class of 2009. A recent psychological study stated that in learning, music is a powerful memory tool for our personal expression within our daily lives. It helps set the scene for many important experiences. For the past four years, music has been able to help reinforce classroom education and extend learning in the outside world. You know, the music playing through the headphones you didn't even try to hide in the halls, or the music blasting out in Mr. Kerr and Miss Muldoon's room that you pulled yourself back from dancing to while you were walking through a hall. The music that gave you the strength to do the best before a big game, a big exam, and whenever you needed more guidance, it was the lyrics of a certain song that helped you get through the day. Lessons learned in high school go beyond the book. And sitting here tonight is clear proof that although the year ends, the music still goes on. Can I take it? The music goes back to as far as freshman year. Freshman year for everyone is unexpected and unwritten. Natasha Bedingfield reminded us that freshman year was a time we were staring at the blank page before you open up the journey and uh, let the sun illuminate the words that you cannot be reaching for something in the distance. <laughs> Walking in what seemed like huge hallways, we were scared of most things. While being a freshman, you face many obstacles, such as adapting to a new environment, meeting new people, and dealing with new challenges. Although our teachers would always be there to help us with studying and schoolwork, when it came to bigger and unfamiliar problems outside the classroom, it was the lyrics of the All-American Rejects, and even when your hope is gone, move along, move along, just to make it through, that helped us seek out our new difficulties. Going through this anything but painless year, you learn that sometimes you will fall. Well, you fall, when you fall, you learn to remember what the rapper Ung sang, now walk it out, now walk it out. <laughs> As we continued walking through the hallways with our earphones glued into our ears, we danced our way into sophomore year. You were no longer new and you had yet to be the upperclassmen. This year was the year that we learned the importance of setting goals, using our mistakes to build a bright future, and our teachers reminded us that this was the year we needed to become stronger. It was time to put our juvenile actions and thoughts to the left, to the left. Mm -hmm. And when we needed a little reliance, <laughs> Kanye West repeated to us, now that that don't kill me can only make me stronger. Mm -hmm. Junior year came here before we knew it, and we were all singing along to the same songs in our first cars with our much anticipated driver's license. We were truly growing up, and it was time to take responsibility for our actions. <laughs> Although it was a relief to now know you can put all your past worries and fears behind you, there was another set of worries coming. The notorious SAT, ACTs, HESPAs would determine our future. And in order to ensure success, we need to take everything one step at a time. Jordan Sparks was singing our ears to hurry up and wait. So close, but so far away. Everything that you've always dreamed of, close enough for you to take, but you just can't touch. Although studying took up most of our time, the music never seemed to stop. It was senior year and it seemed like all eyes on you in the center of the ring just like a certain thing. Until the never ending college decisions came to your attention. Weeks to months of searching and applying finally paid off when you received your letter of admission. You learned to believe in yourself and the feelings of such acceptance made you hop out of bed, turn your swag on, take a look in the mirror, say what's up. And yeah, I'm getting money. <laughs> and after everything you learned, you were now able to just dance. It's gonna be okay. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> Lessons learned in high school go beyond the books. And music has been able to reinforce classroom education and help remind us all that there's a world outside of high school worth learning about. In addition to learning in the classroom, the past four years we've learned the importance of setting goals 
using mistakes to build a bright future, taking responsibility for our actions, and setting high expectations for ourselves. While dancing through the songs of your life, you should never forget, you, forget the songs that got you to where you are today. The songs that drove you to and from high school will now drive you into the next part of your life. Congratulations, class of 2009. Please don't stop the music. <laughs>